Make way for the head of the table. The following contest is a fatal four-way match. Making his way to the ring, representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the World Heavyweight Champion. The undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns! I've been at this table for decades, and I've never seen a competitor this dominant. Month in, month out, Reigns continues to dominate. Yeah, but think about this, Corey. The man who finally puts a loss in Roman's record will become immortal. It's bold of you to think he'll even lose. Well, even with the competition at this level, you might be right. Ships Baron Corbin is raring for a fight. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. The lone wolf mentality is back. No one's safe. And his opponents, first from Kansas City, weighing in at 285 pounds. Baron Corbin's been a king, a jester, an authority figure, even a bum. Yeah, but now Corbin is truly himself. No more gimmicks. Accomplished so much in his young career. Won the Money in the Bank ladder match. Former Golden Gloves boxing champion, NFL offensive lineman, turned champion in WWE. This is one intimidating superstar. I agree with you, Saxton. I pity those who pick a fight with Braun Breaker. And from Woodstock, Georgia, weighing in at 200. And 30 pounds, Braun Breaker! We've seen a fury to Braun Breaker, a fiery temper that fuels him in the ring. And that fire cannot be extinguished. Just look at Breaker's face. The intensity of this man is palpable. Braun looks ready to completely annihilate the opposition. Here he comes, the best in the world. And he's not here to make friends. He's here to make money. Weighing in at 200.
and 18 pounds, C.M. Punk. Who could forget the night of Punk's historic return? But now, Punk must prove himself. Says he's now home, but many competitors have said this is no longer his home. Punk has never been more focused. He's now down to business, and he wants to rewrite his legacy and write a whole new chapter in the WWE. WWE is a different world than when Punk left a decade ago. This company's evolved. Now he must evolve. Punk better evolve, Punk better raise his game, because nowadays there are many who claim to be the best in the world. Every superstar has to be looking over their shoulder in this fatal throwaway match. Things are now underway with Roman Reigns. Baron Corbin, Braun Breaker, and CM Punk. It is going to be extremely interesting to see how things shake out. No time to rest in a fatal four-way match. No rest for the wicked, and we've got four superstars who have nothing but malicious intentions for one another. Nowhere to hide in this one. Two! But meanwhile, Punk. Any superstar has the odds against them entering a fatal four-way. What's the best way to overcome those odds, Corey? Well, there's a few odds in school. You can lay in wait for a moment to capitalize, or you could power through and take everyone on head first. The most important part is breaking up any pinfalls or submissions. Oh, he knew what was coming. Whoa, springboard attack. Can he score the pin? That could have been it right there. Oof, kick finds it. This could be good. Whoa, whoa, maybe slip down there, Wild Thing. Do you really need a pop right now? Looking wobbly in the corner. All's fair in love and war, gentlemen. I saw nothing but effective offense. Oh, man. Turned it into a statement. DDT. like that. Roman gets stopped. Lots of potential for injury here at ringside. These superstars better be careful. The floor, the barricades, our table. None of these things are fun to collide with. Now, oh, tracking the opposition. The natural dominance of Reigns getting a bit challenged there. Unhinged offense from Breaker's arsenal. Oh, look at What a blow. Carefully measured right. Boom, what impact. Into the ring again. Tough position to be caught in here. He moved, but can he capitalize? And he's out of there in a nick of time. Denied with an elbow. Just unloading. And I think Braun's face, too, took the brunt of that shot. The Tribal Chief has acquired the target. Locked, loaded, and looking for the victory. Two. No, two count. Good Lord, scarily close to three. Oh, 
that down with a well-placed kick. Wicked clothesline. Check out this display of power by Braun Breaker way overhead. The military press into the power slam. May have just vanquished Reigns. Somehow he kicked out. Reigns kicks out at two and nine tenths. The Tribal Chief stays alive. He's going for the pin. This could be it. No, he gets the shoulder up. How in the world did he kick out? Got it scouted. And he's taking this to the outside now. Placing them right where they want them, into the corner. Textbooks, we got a cover. And he breaks up the count. Meanwhile, we see Breaker. Reigns cuts him off. Up and down, what a slam. in the nick of time. Oh, this the superstar using the rope as a weapon. This is uncalled for. If a shortcut presents itself, you better take it. Cover! Is that enough? He breaks the pin. Smash like that. Ah, oh, setting them up for an end of the slam. Oh, catches a kick to the face. There's some power behind that punch. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Right hook. Big clothesline. line. Right out of ringside and back to the mat. Roman Reigns is having his way. Two suplexes. A third on the way. Right to the kidneys from behind. Reigns is getting ready. Spiked with a urinaki. The end is looming now. He can really stand to get back as good as he's getting right about now. And he slides him back to the mat. Braun Breaker setting him up for the military slam. Will Breaker finish things now? Big four. The suspense. And the match continues. Belly to belly suplex. Ducking out of trouble. Reigns hits it! Breaker's got a problem here. Cover! Two! Oh, not yet. They just got the shoulder up. Simply abnormal resilience from Breaker. Oh, what a blow! No way. Astounding power. End of days. Incredible. Aaron Corbin can put it away here. Oh, he kicked out. A kick out, and Reigns is still in this. 
The big dog still has some fight left. And you know this is only going to make Corbin angrier now. He wanted to end things right there. The energy in here is palpable. Something truly special is unfolding before our eyes. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Oh. He wins. He wins. Here is your winner, Braun Take a look at the winner of this fatal four-way match, ladies and gentlemen. This was a hectic match, so bravo to the winner. It certainly took guts and quick thinking to earn the victory. A new day, the power of positivity has taken over my hips, my heart, and my entire soul. Come on, guys, clap with me. Sit Dude, down, Saxton. Rock. I will not stop, Corey. Day rocks. The following contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring. And a combined weight of 417 pounds. Xavier Woods and Kofi Kingston, The New Day! What makes The New Day so impressive is the incredible bond these superstars share. Seems like nothing will ever come between them. They celebrate each other's successes and are by each other's sides in loss. Now you really can't help but be inspired by these guys. They've accomplished so many incredible things together. It's true, historic championship reigns, memorable matches, the power of positivity has taken the New Day far. I got a feeling this match is gonna be too sweet. One of the most dominant and decorated teams in the world. And their opponents at a combined weight of 505 pounds. Luke Gallows and Carl Anderson. The we all know the OC loves to have a good time, but the one thing they might love even more is getting into a good old-fashioned fight. Yeah, they brawled all over the world and sometimes with each other. The OC never sleeps on a good fight. Scanning the scene in the ring tonight, and the OC is looking to start up a fight. There's no escape, and that's for sure. Always looking for war.
That's the bell, and the OC is here, set for action. There are really no egos in the OC, guys. They love to fight and then have a good time outside the ring. That's what happens when you spend as much time making money and making towns as these dudes have, Cole. All that matters after that is the company you keep, and the OC knows that all too well. A very tight-knit crew, you have to admire that. And you know that with the New Day, they're going to try to get a frenetic pace going. They're going to channel the energy of the WWE Universe. Ow. <laughs> From behind, neckbreaker. Into the corner now. Look at this, going right after the left arm. Gotta hurt. Not a whole lot you can do with a bum wing, guys. As that was, it has to take something out of a smaller competitor. Luke retaliates. Caught in a bad position here. Put down face first. That's a free fall. Oh, just deadlifting their opponent and tossing them aside. I don't think people realize the amount of strength it takes to hurl someone like that. Tag made what do these two superstars have in store for their opponent? For the record, Saxton, you and I would never have that kind of chemistry. Hey, I'd be a great teammate. I've seen you trip and he goes for the pin. He really thought that was it. That's how you stop your opponent. right into the corner. Tornado DDT! I think we're gonna see it! Bloody cross! Is it enough? There's two! Just barely, but it counts. Those two are in such a cohesive rhythm out there. It's like playing jazz, but using your opponent as the drum. A sound suplex. That was that chemistry you cannot teach. Look at this. Pendulum backbreaker. Tick tock. And Xavier wasn't looking too thrilled there. Set him up. Russian leg sweep. Carl 
showing no fear, no intimidation. He's certainly lining him up, but he's wasting too much time. See that? Um, handle applied. Up and oh wow! He could pin his opponent right here. It's over. No kick out of two. I cannot believe what I'm seeing right now. No one can. Placed into the corner. Looking for a high-risk, high-reward situation. There's the tag. And Woods avoids that one. Big boot. Sequence of reversals here. Both superstars clearly studied game tape ahead of time. Dropped on the knee with a gut buster. He's starting to struggle here. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course they're going to wind up with a few battle scars. This could be it. Cover for the win. Yeah, no, he doesn't get the three. What a match. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Oh, draping double axe handle. Stop to the gut. Ouch. He's going to the pin. This could be it. And to the pay window. Shoulder shoots up before two. All the punishment he's taken, and yet he's still in this match? I think it's about that time, gentlemen. Time for him. Hit drop. I've been waiting to see that. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Woods top rope with the lemon break elbow. That could be Gallo's demise. Cover by uh -huh. teammate makes the save. And just in time. Kofi Kingston is tagged in. What a shot. And Luke Gallows just taunting his opponent now. He catches Gallows with a big counter. Oh, costly error there. Left by the turnbuckles. Double big back body drop. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Right in the Look at it. Could be it. He's able to beat a two count. 
refusing to give up even an inch of ground as this match continues. Uses the edge of the knee. Uh-oh. He's got the answer for that one. Carl Anderson, boom, rocket kick. He may get the three count right here. I think so. <laughs> kick to the gut. Cranked around into a neck breaker. And he gets set back into the ring. Kingston feeling the energy, the energy from this crowd. Ringing the arm, looking now for a top wrist lock. Oof. But here comes Anderson. Well, Anderson with the gun start. Anderson could seal things up. Ah, finally, monumental victory. Here are your winners, Carl Anderson and Luke Gallows. The making their case for one of the best teams around with that win. This right pairing can certainly do wonders, and make no mistake, this was a wonderful performance tonight. We are about to hear the sinister siren song of Scarlet. It is a tune that has struck fear in the entire WWE Universe. One of the most dominant competitors in NXT history. TikTok Doomsday has arrived.
The time has come to fall and pray. The Alpha Academy is here. Byron, I've always wanted to do this. Shoosh! And his opponent, accompanied by Maxine Dupree, representing the Alpha Academy from Kobe, Japan, weighing in at 156 pounds, Akira. You know, Alpha Academy may look like a bunch of oddballs, but they're legit. I wouldn't be surprised if they're really an accredited academy. They're highly trained, highly intelligent, and highly competitive. They certainly think so. Two absolute geniuses of the mat game. Yeah, tonight we're about to see their thesis. This is the man who has seemingly put the entire WWE locker room on notice. The sadistic and uncaring Karrion Cross. Look into that man's eyes, Cole. Cross has a method to his madness, and once he has you in his sights, there is nothing you can do about it. Just a walking combination of unbridled intensity, precision, and total ruthlessness is carrying Cross. But you cannot underestimate a superstar like Tazawa. He has proved that sometimes big things come in small packages. A big personality with the ability to throw around much bigger superstars than himself. You don't want Tozawa to catch you sleeping, because he will German suplex you in response. Ankle lock, and the rope save him there. But will he be able to last much longer? And he denies Cross. Oh, she has bad intentions now. Removing the turnbuckle pad. That's a prime example of pulling out all the stops towards a victory. It just goes to show you, sometimes you've got to dig deep to compete. Jeez. Effective arm drag. That kick will stop you in your tracks. So much torque on the knee and ankle. Ah, oh, stops the legs. Carrion Cross boasts an impressive physique, but what's the best way for him to utilize that power tonight? Cross needs to mix that strength with ruthless precision. By making targeted attacks, he can use all that muscle to debilitating effect and end his opponent's night quickly. Planning on what to do next. Was tossed. He thinks he has it. Gets the shoulder up after one. He is certainly sending a message, getting his shoulder up before two. Big time power bomb. A power bomb's not meant to be pretty, but oh man, does it get the job done. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they don't want to be taking any more of those. Oh, what a kick. Boom, what a kick. Dodges. Would you look at this? She is removing the turnbuckle pad now. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. He turns it around. This is gonna hurt. Cross with the doomsday Saito. Karrion Cross showing absolutely no mercy. Yeah, whatever deity his opponent was appealing to, they were not answering the phone. Submission. I have no idea how he hasn't. And he releases the hold. I don't think he had it fully locked in. 
Oh, this is just too far. Get some control in there. Oh, it is a... from not kicking out next time. A torturous knee. Kick right to the back of the... Uh-oh, he could be looking for a submission here. How do you escape the abdominal stretch like that? Headed up, he's thinking back. Ah, oh, took off the uh, the hood of the ass tail. Now there go the monitors. Bad intentions in mind here. Come on, Byron, get in front of me. No. Three. From the top. Oh. And he said, "You're not getting me with that this time." That elbow looked like it hurt. Tozawa manages the counter. And set right into the corner. Oh my goodness! Not so fast. Hurricane Rana. Good grief. Oh, that hurt right to the kidney. Golly. German suplex. Shot to the gut will break things up. What the heck is this manager doing looking out of the ring? She can't be acting like this. Himself some room to regroup fast. Things do not look good for him now, guys. But if anyone can jumpstart a rally, it is Tazawa. Saw that one coming, took advantage. Oh, the right suplex. Oh man, he is. He thinks he has it. Powers out. That's really as close as it gets. Just Tazawa looking. Big forearm. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. Boom! Nice takedown. Could be looking for the triangle. Got to pass the arm. Needs to break this submission, and the left hands will do it. He got whipped into that corner. Oh! From the top! Tozawa from way up high! Center! Carry hands out of it! What? Only two? The sands of the hourglass were dwindling for Cross, and he was able to flip it. I thought it was over. The WWE. WWE Universe thought it was over, but you gotta do a little more to finally finish this. These men have given everything they have and more at this point. This is a critical moment now to see who can find a way to keep going. Jarring impact. Oh, flipping the script on him there. A stalemate of counters. Big boot! So much damage inflicted. The power of Tozawa showing here. And Tozawa might have more in store. Everyone watching this is on pins and needles. What a match. A battle for the ages. You can't help but get amped. If this works, it could change the course of the match. From the top, Tozawa, what a center. Will Tozawa put it away here? That's good. Here is your winner, Akira Kozawa. And
tonight. Failure befalls Karrion Cross. Cross isn't the type to forgive or forget, so let's not assume this is over. One of the hardest hitting high flyers around. Ready for takeoff. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring. Representing the LWO from Mexico City, Mexico. Weighing in at 200 pounds. Some folks. Well, it is time to pay oh, yeah. respect to the boss oh, yeah. of the street. Santos Escobar does not play games. Escobar is calm, steady, calculated, and does whatever he has to do to succeed. When Escobar joined WWE, he arrived here under a mask, but he quickly put the past behind him. He evolved. He became the superstar we know today. That change seems like a very good one for Santos. Here comes main event, Jey Uso. And his opponent from San Francisco, California, weighing in at 242 pounds. Oh, what a cheap shot. That's just evening the playing field, Cole. What a disgrace. And the referee is motioning for these superstars to get into the ring where this match belongs. I'm not sure there's any reasoning with them at this point. Succeed against Jay Uso. You must keep your focus on Jay at all times. Jay is fast and an agile competitor who has the ability to strike from anywhere. Keep him squarely in your sights at all times. You won't be caught off guard and you might find an opening of your own to attack. Looking for a schoolboy. Uh oh. Super kick! He's lost some of his win now. He planned for this and could still rally. Uh oh. Elbow drop. Whip back into the ring. And now this match is officially begun. I'm not even sure the word official is in their vocabulary at this point. <laughs> I think you're right, Saxton, and I love it. And he has an answer for Jay.
First, a knife edge chop, and now continuing the attack on the knee. Straight to the knee. Goes without saying, but a leg injury will hamper your ability to do just about anything. Took it off the knee. Just doing anything they can to chip away at the base. their offense with a swift elbow to the gut. Super kick! And he's able to reverse. That'll turn your lights out. Off the ropes. Uh-oh. He avoids the damage. Just one step ahead. Side headlock applied. Oh, and a right hand for good measure. Able to reverse. <laughs> Utilizing the top rope to inflict more punishment. Draped over the top rope. <laughs> Drives a foot into the stomach. Escobar has set his target. And Jay reverses. Looking for a belly to back suplex into the neck breaker. Beautiful. And shoulders are down. Two. He narrowly avoids the count. Able to squeeze that shoulder out. So close. Escobar avoids that one. Chop. Uh-oh. This isn't going to be pretty. Nice suplex. And these guys are trying to prove they belong in the main event. That they are on top of the mountain here. Big time confidence leading to big time matches. I love it. He's taking this to the floor now. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Uh-oh. What are they going to do here? How about a little gory spot? Trying to find a way out. Elbow into an arm drag. Beautiful escape. Some power behind that punch. What a close line. Yeah. Heavy body shots. Whipped hard. Oh, what a combo. A quick response to Jay's offense. Look at Jay, his lights are off. And Santos is your winner. Here is your winner, Santos Escobar. Jay so unable to get the win here tonight. Jay just needs to tap into that main event spirit, dust himself off, and be more prepared.
Here comes the architect, Seth Rollins, the self-proclaimed future of WWE. Ready to go and do exactly what he does best. The following contest is a triple threat tag team match. Introducing first, representing the authority from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, Seth Rollins. Cocky, crafty, conniving, Seth Rollins is one heck of an athlete, but his ego and attitude have obviously eclipsed his otherwise impressive talent. Okay, Cole, crafty, yeah, you yourself dubbed him the architect, Cole, conniving, he simply has vision. Cocky? Why wouldn't he be? He's the future of this company, like it or not. Sometimes it can be hard to tell just how good Seth Rollins really is, but he really is capable in the ring. We've seen that before and we'll no doubt see that tonight. Well, I'd say he's more than capable. Rollins believes he's on a whole other level, and it's hard to argue against that. The WWE Universe is on their feet. Showing respect for the game. The Cerebral Assassin. Few men have ever commanded attention like Triple H. And representing the authority from Greenwich, Connecticut, weighing in at 200. And 55 pounds, the game, Triple Ace! We are moments away from a true exhibition of authority. In the ring, he commands respect. He's a technical mastermind. Triple H has seen it all. Triple H has done it all. And much like his nickname says, Triple H is always at the top of his game. The creator of the pedigree, a truly devastating move. Yeah, and he's mastered how, when, and where to utilize it. Yeah, the pedigree almost always guarantees the end for Triple H's opponent. I guarantee Triple H already has plans on when to use it tonight. Watch out. Here comes the MVP of Chase U. Michael, I can barely hear myself think. The Duke section is going nuts. And we're presenting Chase U from Adelaide, South Australia, weighing in at 253 pounds. Duke Hudson! Duke has made Chase U the accredited, prestigious institution it is today. You have to respect Duke's journey. He experienced a new level of success when he started taking his studies seriously. Well, Duke has all the pieces needed to become a breakout star. Now he needs to put them all together. We know Duke understands the assignment. He's the one who created it. Check page five of the syllabus. Mm hmm yeah, Duke did his thesis on the empowerment of striking first and taking matters into your own hands.
Class is in session, gentlemen. And representing Chase U from Draper, North Carolina, weighing in at 216 pounds, Andre Chase. Well, there's plenty of bravado when this man speaks, but he has quickly become a mentor to many in NXT and WWE. I think he'll have even more enrollment after this match. Like him or not, Andre Chase is a quick thinker when the pressure's on. Well, the pressure is on tonight. The Creeds have arrived. A team they whose tenacity is without equal. 515 pounds. Brutus. And Julius, the Creed Brothers! The Creeds, pure athletes and superior technicians who are relentless in their pursuit of victory. The team's strengths are built on their dedication to training and excellence in every part of their life. One of the greatest teams in NXT history, they have already made a major impact on the rest of WWE. There we go. Superstars finally enter the ring, and we are officially underway. Big knee to the midsection. And that was an effective attack, guys. Damn! Down he goes. And he's able to counter. Big hammer connects. Crashing down like that, having the wind knocked out of you. Never a good time for that to happen. Race lock applied, but able to block into an arm drag. Thunderous club comes down on the apron. Uh -oh. And Creed gets warded off. Clearly no low loss between these two with a display like that. Corey, so many things can transpire in a matchup like this. What could be that elusive X factor? It is mission critical to be adaptable. If it's anything goes, then use that to your advantage before your opponent does. This is an environment where a competitor can be reminded real quick what goes around comes around. And you might be forced to revamp your strategy when you least expect it. Swing for the fences with a kendo stick. Send your opponent crashing through a table. Fight up the ramp. Whatever insanity you can come up with is fair game. Disrupts the attack with an elbow to the gut. Put it in position now. Textbook scoop slam. And they just busted out an impactful maneuver. Oh, oh, face first. Andre Chase getting taught a lesson of his own. Furious offense from Rollins. His temper's flaring right now. Elbow thrown to break up the maneuver. Oh, that's unnecessary. Thunderous power. Picture perfect example for when you just want to put someone down with authority. Oh, and a right hand for good measure. Oh, sledge and water speed. It's not over yet. Plenty left to go in this one. Suplex! Oh! Oh, man! Dominating shoulder tackle. You want to control the tempo. You want to dictate the pace. That right there is how you do it. It's incredible. The inventiveness we are seeing on display here. Dismantling your opponent. Escape just in time. Did you hear the impact? Julius.
Capri taking hold. Oh, sent flying. I'll just leave it at this. Nobody comes into a match hoping to get chucked around like that. Ah, uh, left into a German. Talk about intimidation. I'm not sure if it's resilience or stupidity that's going to drive you to try and come back from a move like that. Sleeper hold cinched in deep. And breaks out of the sleeper. German suplex with the release. Oh, what a drop kick. On the mark. That is the kind of move that leaves our jaws on the floor. Unbelievable. Meanwhile, Chase. Two just kicks out. Close call. That was almost lights out. so many ways, making it harder to execute on even simple attacks. He's got him down. Is this it? Gets the shoulder up. He's still in the fight, but for how much longer? T-Bone into a power slam. Impressive. He's in a little bit of trouble now. Gut wrench power bomb. You have to question what kind of match of tennis behind a with that much force. On the apron. That turns it around for Duke. Off they go. Oh, atomic drop. Oh, the chair projected right to their face. German suplex. Oh, what a tackle. Big form. Had that one scouted. Bash straight into the post on the outside. These superstars have endured so much punishment. Certainly looking worse for wear, but the tide can shift at it. Butterfly got longer hook up and face buster. Andre got it. Can he end it? Position and now muscling up there. Great, devastating crucifix bomb. There's two. Guys, he put him away. That's a pretty big win. An unyielding showing of authority. No two ways about Here it. Here are your winners. Duke Hudson and Andre Chase. Chase University. An emphatic victory for your winners. An impressive effort from this duo. After that win, this superstar stock is rising, and they are dancing all the way to the pay window.
The Alpha Academy is here. Byron, I've always wanted to do this. Sheesh! The following contest is a tag team match scheduled for one fall. Making their way to the ring at a combined weight of 532 pounds. Chad Gable and Otis, the Alpha Academy. You know, Alpha Academy may look like a bunch of oddballs, but they're legit. I wouldn't be surprised if they're really an accredited academy. They're highly trained, highly intelligent, and highly competitive. They certainly think so. Two absolute geniuses of the mat game. Yeah, tonight we're about to see their thesis. WWE Universe, it is time to join the raid. Well, Ivar is ready to dismantle the competition. And their opponents, first, representing the Viking Raiders from Valhalla, weighing in at 305 pounds, one half of the NXT Tag Team. Champions, Ivar! Living proof that looks can be deceiving. Ivar is as agile as he is powerful. A very difficult opponent to prepare for. entertainment immortality since birth a standout in college football one of the greatest performers in wwe history and now the biggest star on the planet a third generation superstar who honors his family starting all the way at the top with the high chief, Peter Maivia. Without a doubt, furthering his family's legacy in sports entertainment and cementing his own spot on the WWE Mount Rushmore. His greatness transcends eras in WWE history. Powered up in the iron paradise, Team Bring It is a lifestyle. This is great. Legal superstars now in the ring, and the referee signals for the bell. And I wouldn't go anywhere. Don't even blink. This has classic written all over it. Boom. He gets tagged in. Uh-oh. Ankle pick. Beautiful takedown. Oh, God.
Pulled in for a belly to belly. Nice amateur takedown. All the way over. Oh, what a kick. He deflects it right back. Close line. Well, that'll leave a mark. He made it. Tag made. Hoist their opponent all the way up, letting the world absorb their plans, making it look easy. Wow! Stalling suplex. Oh, look at this. Just cranking the head. That's got to hurt. Cranking the head. Oh, to the arm. Terrible. That's using your head. Throwing out their deadlifting prowess and just tossing them aside. It couldn't have felt good being chucked around like that. Down to bonus and a double axe handle smash. Now he's been put on the defensive. He's looking more like a schoolyard bully than a tutor after that move. Oh my, how in the world did he kick out of that? It'll take more than that to hold him down. Otis with the reversal. Counter answered by another counter. Ooh, right to the arm. Tag made. Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. Dominating cross body. Springboard. The Rock tagged in. Ooh, stiff punt. Sleeper holds it and just able to make it to the ropes. That was a close call. or a wasted opportunity to attack your opponent. Able to get there in time. Fisherman suplex. Kick to the stomach puts an end to that. One response after another. Back and forth we go. That puts a stop to Gable. Getting him into the corner. Look at this, going right after the left arm. Got to hurt. And Gable's lesson plan just got thrown off. Yeah, that's the kind of offense that opened people's eyes to the rock. Oh, what a close line. Forcefully delivered. Tag made, fresh man in. Big forearm. behind it. something in the corner. Suplex! Gets the tag. Double leg step through. Uh-oh. You know what's coming next? Legendary Scorpion! And the sharp shooter is applied. What a unique... Su He's trying to push himself up, and that'll cause a break. Takedown, went over the cross face, gets cinched in. They're gonna free the arm and does just that. 
The Rock set up for the Rock bottom. The Rock got all of it. Two. Kicks out. Just kicked out. The alpha superiority from Chad Gable keeping him in this match. It isn't over yet. The Rock has to find a way to persevere right now if he wants to end this. In full control here. Face full of turnbuckle. Dismantling the arm in the corner. Oh, putting focus on the arm here. In the corner he goes. A perfectly placed target. Beautiful dragon screw takedown. Seamless transition into the leg lock. Tap, tap. He takes control. Clean tag for his partner. Incredible energy. Uh oh, ankle pick. Beautiful takedown. Oh, knee crusher. That's gonna hurt. They gave him now chains some offense together. A rock is not looking good here. Fends off the attack with an elbow. And that might be the start of the momentum swing Chad needed. Could be the table turner Chad desperately needed. Oh, and he's back in, beating the count. Tossed into the corner. Headlock applied, and a nice short jab to the bridge of the nose. And on that exchange, it looked like Ivar lost some focus. Yeah, as that competitive streak of the Alpha Academy really shined through there. Here he goes for the win! Can he close it out? Kicks out after one. There is no quit in this man tonight. There's a tag. Uh-oh. Turned it around into a massive bulldog. Tag is made, and he's coming in hot. Oh, man. Launched with a belly-to-belly. Man. He's been placed in the corner now. Oh man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Hooked up. Diddy T. He may be in a bad way here. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? Take him down with a chop block. Had it scouted. Oh, man. Right to the arm. Hyper extend your help. might be wavering. The Rock's opponent needs to know his role. Really just laying it in. Oh, he creates some separation with power. Boom! The referee counted, urging them to get in the ring. The number one guy clearly has confidence, but might be using the wrong muscle here. Stay on him, Otis. Big punch finds its mark. Punch! Set him up. Russian leg sweep. And crucial juncture now for The Rock. 
It is scratching and clawing time if Otis wants to stay in this. And a reversal by Otis. Placed in the corner. Oh, targeting the arm. This has got to hurt. your opponent. Whoa, a stiff headbutt. Oh, uncorked the five arms vulnerable here. He saw that one coming. Oh, impact to the... Uh-oh. And he denies Ivar. Headbutt to the back of the neck. Oh, what a chancery. This has been a colossal battle to this point. No superstar is showing signs of backing down. We are seeing all their best on display, but it might just come down to who can take advantage of a pivotal mistake. Oh, saw it coming. What are you guys thinking? Obviously not about the rest count, Cole. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Well, the last second beat the count out. up their opponent driven down with a sidewalk slam this place is going insane the ground beneath my feet is shaking headlock applied and a nice short jab to the bridge of the nose oh that hurt right to the kidney Golly. Chad Gable with a German suplex not done yet has not released arm still claps around the waist a second German suplex Will Gable make it pay off? Cover. One, two, Able to stop the pin count here. Tag is registered. He's getting fired up now, really feeding off this crowd. And there was some force on that move. Otis is hungry. Otis is ready. with the reversal. He got whipped into that corner. One more time. Uh -oh. Tornado DDT. And the rock gets wounded off. Tag. 
This could be big. Powerful takedown. The Rock just got checked in. Shoulders down. He stopped the count for his partner. is on its feet. The Rock has it hooked. Rock bottom. Rock got it. I think it's over. The cover. Oh, I thought it was over, but again. Can we please get some control? Into the corner. This can't be good. Boom! What a right. Oh, what a clubbing blow. Kick right to the body. Taking the wind out with a stomp to the solar plexus. The Rock is becoming a bloody mess in there. Clearly waiting for that. Close line. And this has got to be it. Almost ended it there. There's some shock in the arena after that kick out. The DDT. Does he get him here? One, two, three. Heat. Grueling matchup. And look who's here. Ah, oh, some taunting going on. Future matchup, perhaps? I'd say that's a highly likely possibility. The American Nightmare has arrived. The son of a dream looking to realize his destiny in WWE. following contest is scheduled for one fall making his way to the ring 
from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, the American Nightmare! Cody Rhodes has been on a mission as of late to solidify his position at the top of the WWE. He reached the main event of WrestleMania. Now it's time to finally finish the story. You can compare him to his father, his brother, but Cody has been dead set on forging his own path to success. While certainly honoring his family, Cody knows this is his time to shine. And a win tonight goes a long way towards that. It's time to go big or go home. And his opponent representing the New Day from Tampa, Florida, weighing in at 285 pounds, Big The more his personality has shown through, the more dangerous he's become. Now Big E loves to have fun, but his idea of fun is usually rather dangerous to the competition. Superstars in the ring, and the referee officially starts the match. Well, this is the way we're starting, Cole. I think the WWE Universe is in for quite a show tonight. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. That was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. He's able to sidestep there. Back elbow finds the mark. Elbow after elbow. Endless attack here. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. And he has an answer for Big E. Oh, he's looking to completely render this leg useless. Stump puller leg snap. Very effective. Stomping. Ouch. They're going to wear down their opponent. Oh, with the heel hook stretch. Oh, weakening the leg here. Uh-oh, great counter. Belly to belly suplex. Down on the chest. Thunderous power slam. Powerless position to be in right now. Oh man, taking it to the trachea. Ooh, that might have just broken something. Ooh! Big E is obviously known for his size and power, but he's also surprisingly agile. Corey, what do you think is Big E's best bet here? To rely on the expected, that size and power, or to perhaps focus on that surprising speed? Well, at the end of the day, Cole, Big E can slow down like anyone else, but his pop cover! Only a one count before the kick out. And those kick outs are only going to get harder. Cody Rhodes rallying up the crowd like only a Rhodes can. By the throat into the top rope. Oof. Cody possibly realizing his opponent might be just as dangerous as he is. Yeah, Big E really took control right there. Big time powerbomb. That was a powerbomb with one message in mind. Absolute destruction. Oh my God. Nothing was being held back with each of those strikes. Leaving himself open here. He's one step ahead there. Sent into the corner. What a collision. Big E. What a splash. Big E showing off that impressive powerhouse status there. 
The powerhouse of the New Day has his opponent up. The big ending from Big E. Serious jeopardy for Rhodes. Two count. Oh, kick out, kick out of two. The resilience on display from Cody Rhodes is a common occurrence that never gets old. Big E looking frustrated here, guys. He really needs to dial back in and refocus on the task at hand. Big E not worried one bit about the competition. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. And this might not have a pleasant ending. Piercing the throat. Incredible pressure being put on Rhodes. Big E is relying on that power, and it's giving him the advantage right now. And Cody Rhodes reverses. And Cody puts a stop to the momentum that was mounting against him. But Cody has to push now while the window's open. Oh. Kick right to the midsection. Cody looking for the win. Catch Rhodes. Cody Rhodes nailed it. As close to three as you could possibly get without the bell ringing. Big forearm. The WWE Universe is pouring. Cody looking to end this. Crossroads. Is that all she wrote for Big E? Two. Oh, what a big celebration and a massive win tonight. Hard fought victory, incredibly physical matchup, but earn the right to celebrate here tonight. Wait, this is more fun than celebration. Oh, this from behind. More fun. This is classless. Oh, steel steps. Come on. A standoff here in the uh, middle of the ring. You can feel how bad these competitors are ready to go at it right now. And oh, look at this. Handshake offered and accepted. It's the calm before the storm. These two are going to go at it. That was mutual respect between the competitors. Well, I appreciate true sportsmanship. This match is underway, and I have to commend them for that display of esteem between these superstars. Not just a show of respect. Off the top, diving arm drag. I like yours better, Cole. It takes a certain level of athleticism to pull that off. Ooh. Into the barricade. Power from the suplex. Oh. Man, what an upper. 
uppercut. Taking this to the floor. Not the position you want to be in right now. Before the two count. Just using the adrenaline to stay in the match. We're no closer to a winner just yet. Ooh, stinging kick. Corey, in your eyes, what is Sami Zayn's biggest advantage in this matchup? No, oh, that's an easy one, Cole. Sami Zayn's a strategic mastermind. That'll give him a clear path to victory. All he has to do is properly execute them. Shaken. Ah. Quick strike to the lower body. He steers clear of contact. Dismantling the arm in the corner. Gotta hurt. That kind of force in the arm can have lingering effects. And Carmelo gets stifled. Has them hooked, looking for sliced bread. Oh, countered into a power slam. Hayes quick to counter. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Running knee. Paying it right back with a reversal. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Oh. Sammy Zayn looking for it. Blue Thunder Bomb. Zayn finding that. This is it. And Zayn is clearly looking for a fight here. Ah, oh, kick! Nasty kick. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. And Zayn looking a bit worse for wear after being on the receiving end of that offense. Well, all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. Oh, right in there. Showing some extra scouting, knowing how to answer a counter with a counter of your own. Positioning himself, closing in. Watch out. Hayes hits nothing but net. End of the line for Zane. Two count, and they're still in this. Oh, man, what a kick out. Sami Zayn remains one of the most tenacious superstars around. And it may just take going to the well one more time with that maneuver. Up high. Consecutive high-risk maneuvers, and the pace of this match has certainly picked up. Whoa. Out of the ring. What's his plan here? Ooh. Ooh. Has Sammy ended it there? This one is headed outside, guys. Stop to the gut, too. This is turning into an all-out battle. No holding back. We could be here all night with the way things are going. Just cranking the head. Stop in the leg. And Sammy's finding the energy to get ahead in the fight. 
deep in, and Carmelo might be close to hitting the panic button. Compromised position here. Oh, look at this. Carmelo is losing his grasp for this match now. Everything's coming together for Sammy, executing beautifully on his master plan. Will it be? Sammy Zayn wins. Here is your winner, Sammy Zayn. When you share mutual respect with your opponent, it can give you a confidence boost. It looks like that boost helped one more than the other here, though. Come on, Byron, not everyone can win. I have to say, seeing this win is a great example to set for the entire WWE Universe. Respect, skill, and the victory? I agree, Byron. The following contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring and a combined weight of 501 pounds. Solo Sikoa and Jimmy Uso, the Bloodline. The WWE Universe more than ready to see this one start. This is going to be good. Everyone show some reverence for Imperium. One of the most disciplined groups WWE has ever seen. Looking ready to dish out some punishment.
and their opponents, accompanied by Gunther, and a combined weight of 440 pounds, Giovanni Benci and Ludwig Kaiser, Imperium! It's amazing, guys. Everything about Imperium runs like clockwork. Yeah, they walk in lockstep, exhibit teamwork. There are zero holes in the game of Imperium. And it's a testament to their mission statement. The mat is sacred. As regimented as a military unit, Imperium will beat you down with ruthless efficiency. It's actually kind of scary. They attack with clockwork timing and precision. Finally, all superstars make it to the ring and we are officially underway. After the way this match started, I can't wait to see where it goes from here. Using the forearm to their advantage. Look, the most intelligent competitor in a battle knows that there are many roads to victory. Oh, it's soon. We could be... He is in serious trouble here and finds his way out. Set up in the corner of the ring. To the gut, kick to the stomach with the reversal. What a forearm! Close line in the corner. Boom! DDT. Shoulders down. This could be it. Kick out at one. A truly impressive kick out this late, and he barely evades. top of the action. At this point of the match, I'm not surprised. Vicious right forearm. Clubbing blow to the back. And Vinci turning it around. Jumping neck breaker. Can he do it here? Couldn't quite slam the door yet. He went right into that turnbuckle. Torturous focus on the leg in the corner. Wrestling 101. If you can't stand, you can't fight. can do some lasting damage to the spine. Yeah, no chiropractor has a cure for what we just saw. There's non-stop blows. Great job anticipating Jimmy. Tag! Sent out to the center of the ring. Double super kick! It's gotta be demoralizing when you're the combatant on the wrong side of the double team. Maybe you wanna rework the game plan about now. So it looks like Giovanni's bleeding after that exchange. Placing them into the corner. That's a hold of the arm, a chop for good measure. Not done yet. What agility. Nice arm drag. Agility like that is what can set you apart from the rest of the locker room. Enough already. Uh-oh. He's got him scouted. Great strength being shown here. Oh, right to the throat. He's tagging out. And gets
gets tossed back into the mat. And look at Kaiser is all business now. I oh, had that well scouted. Oh, great display of strength with the suplex. And an elbow drop for added measure. Between them. Vicious, downright savage club right there. Oh man, leg drop arm breaker. Death. The cover. No, he kicks out. Doesn't go well if you still can't get more than a one count by now. In the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. Boom, solo with a timely counter. The adrenaline is pumping. Tag. Uh-oh, sets him up. That's one for Sokoa before. by the skin of his teeth. That didn't go as solo picture. Sky high! Way up there. That vicious streak of Jimmy Uso somewhat returned in kind there. Expert training helped Kaiser land that attack. The head scissor takedown. Shot to the throat. Ludwig gets out of the way. These two battling to a dead heat with these reversals. And a big right hand. Now's the time to find that second win. Find that rush of adrenaline to push you forward. Up to the top rope. And from the top. Oh, an elbow drop. Oh, that was a piercing elbow. Way to steer clear. Here it comes. Nicely done. Yes, tag. Oh, stomping away. Single leg drop kick caught him. Oh, man, right to the arm. 
Undertaker extends your elbow. What a crossbody. Is it enough? The cover! And he kicks out of the pin in one. Not quite enough to put him away. Shifts it back onto him. Oh, impressive counter. Oh, perfect kick. And the cover for the win. This is it. Breaks the count. I am in shock. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? Boom, what a punch. Hey, you can't do that. Tag made. Oh, oh there's a kick right to the face. Double the punishment. Kick to the gut. And scissor into the takedown. And Jimmy able to reverse that. Put into the corner now. Tagged in. Solid punch. Look at this straight. Incredible power slam. He's absorbing some tough hits now. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? Big, big back body drop. What elevation. This arena is rolling. I think the desk is shaking. Now, this is a textbook example of how to bend the rules. Using the forearm to their advantage. My goodness, is this even legal? I don't think so. My God, enough! Here he comes off the tag. He was elusive there. Vinci. Oh my! What a display! And there's the cover! And there's the save! Struggling a bit here. Yeah, they stuck it out through this match, but it wouldn't hurt to go for the tag soon here. Tag. Fails to connect on the springboard. What reflexes to stop Sokoa? Ludwig Kaiser for the win. That's Bruton. That's going to keep Sokoa down. For sure, within inches of victory, only to have it snatched away. This match just keeps getting more and more exciting. That move has brought victory before, but not on this occasion. Might be time to think outside the box. He's been placed in the corner now. Oh, what a forearm! All right, we're gonna grind the features off their face oh, right across the top row. You can't take much more of this. Might want to walk it off or shake it off or do whatever he needs to do to get his head in the game here.
this onrush has got to be draining Sokoa. This is what it feels like to run into a competitor like Ludwig Kaiser. And tag, he did it. Let's go. Stop dead in their tracks with a shot to the face. Close line. Uh-oh. Hits him with the counter. are showing. And 
Gucci turning it around. Gut wrench suplex. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Enough already. And Vinci is keeping the match at his pace. Sokoa needs to better assess the situation to turn this around. He's burying elbows in the midsection. And that's it. Scores the win for the team. Here are your winners. Giovanni Vinci and Ludwig Kaiser. Imperium! A count out win is still a win. It's not the prettiest, most honorable, or even the most fun way to win, but hey, count outs happen.